Hello, good evening. How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Okay, very good. Uh, Fernando, how are you? Hello, hello. Uh, I'm fine. Hello, hello. Carmen, how are you tonight? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, very good. Estela, how are you tonight? I'm fine. Very good. Luis, how are you tonight? I'm fine. Very good. And Mario, how are you tonight, Mario? Very well tonight. Okay, very good. So we're going to start with the ones that are already on, okay? And uh, do you remember that we that we work on this, right? On the simple present questions. Do you get up early? No, I get up late. Does he eat lunch at noon? No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. Do they take the bus to class? No, they take the bus. No, they take the subway. What time do you get up? At 10 o'clock. What time does he have dinner? At 8 o'clock. When do they take the subway? On Tuesdays and on Thursdays. Okay. So, okay, let's see. Very good. So, Mario, maybe you can turn off your microphone. Well, turn it on because we are going to repeat. Good evening, uh, Lorena. Okay, so everybody repeat after me. Turn on your microphones, please. Okay, repeat after me. Do you get up early? Do you get up early? Do no, get up early? I get up late. No, I get up late. Does he eat lunch at noon? Uh, he eats lunch at noon. No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. Do they take the bus to class? Do they take the bus to class? No, they take the subway. No, they take the subway. Okay, what time do you get up? What time do you get up? At 10 o'clock. At 10 o'clock. Okay. Uh, what time does he have dinner? What time does he have dinner? Turn on your microphone, Estela, Fernando, Saul, Lorena, ah, okay. Gerardo. So I can hear, I can hear your pronunciation. Turn on your microphone, Gerardo, Lorena. Enciendan su micrófono, Gerardo y Lorena. Eh, es algo perdido. ¿Qué están leyendo, teacher? Okay, Estamos leyendo. Ah, no he compartido, ¿verdad? Vaya, ahora no. les voy a compartir qué es lo que estoy, qué es lo que estoy leyendo, ¿ok? Esto es lo que estoy leyendo. Para, permítame, no, no es eso. Okay. Ya le indico. Esto es lo que estoy leyendo. Ok. Repeat after me. Do you get up early? No, I get up late. No, I get up late. Does he eat lunch at noon? Does he eat lunch at noon? No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. Okay, do they take the bus to class? Do they take the bus to class? No, they take the subway. No, they take the subway. 
What time do you get up? What time? What time, time do you get up? up? At 10 o'clock. At 10 o'clock. What time does he have dinner? What time, what time does, does he have dinner? dinner? At 8 o'clock. At 8 o'clock. When do they take the subway? When do when they, they take the, the subway? On Tuesdays and Thursdays. On Tuesdays and Thursdays. Okay, very good. Questions? No. No questions. Okay, now we are going to do this exercise again. Number one, do you get up early on weekdays? Okay, Fernando, number two. What time do you go home on Fridays? Excellent, very good. Mario, number three. Does your father work on weekends? Does your father work on weekends? Very good. Gerardo, number five. Ah, number four. Does your mother cook every day? Does your mother cook, cook every day? Very good. Lorena, number five. Do your parents read in the evening? Do your parents read in the evening? Very good. Saul Barmore, number six. When do your parents shop? When do your parents shop? Very good. Estela, number seven. Do you check your email at night? Excellent. Number eight, Luis. When do you study? No, uh, number eight. What time do you have dinner? What time do you have dinner? Very good. Reina, number nine. Does your best friend drive to class? No, number nine. Number nine. Reina, number nine. When do you study? When do you study? Very good. Carmen, number 10. Turn on your microphone. Okay. Okay. Number? Number 10. Uh, does your best friend drive to class? Does your best friend drive to class? Very good. Very good. Okay. And the last one, volunteer. Voluntario. Volunteer. What time does your father get up? Does your father get up? Okay, what time does your father get up? All right. Okay, now here we have to put the words in order to make a question. For example, do you check your, your email every day? Check your email and every day, okay? Now, yes, I check my email every day, okay? Okay, question number two. Vaya, le voy a dar un par de minutos, okay? Para que hagan las preguntas, okay? L look at the answer. Aquí la respuesta es at 1 p.m. Entonces, ¿cómo debería ser la pregunta? What time? What, what time, time eat lunch? Uh -huh. what, time what time do you eat lunch? By escribanla rápidamente. What time do you eat lunch? What time do you eat lunch? Very good. Okay, now let's go to number three. What is the question? Look, the answer is no. This class starts at nine o'clock. So what what is the question? Does, Does this class this class start, 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 start at, at nine o'clock? At eight o'clock. Ah, at nine. Eight o'clock. At, at eight, eight o'clock. Exactly. At eight o'clock. Okay. Write down. Escriba la pregunta quickly. Does this class start at eight o'clock? Write it down. Okay, you got it? Very good. Now, number four. 
The answer is, I study English in the evening. So what is the question? When do you? When, when do you study English? When do you study English? Very good, excellent. Write the question. When do you study English? Excellent. Now, let's go to number five. Look at the answer. Yes, we play soccer on Saturday. So what is the question? Do you and your friends play do you, weekend? Uh -huh. do you and your friends? Do you and your friends play, play, your friends on play sports on weekend? Oh, okay, yes. write it down. Write down the question, please. Hurry up. Write down the question. Do you and your friends play sports? Sports on weekends. On weekends. Ya le escribieron. Yeah. Vaya. Fíjense bien. Esto es lo que vamos a hacer ahora. Eh, yo le voy a pedir que tome una foto para que practiquemos pregunta y respuesta. ¿Ok? Y lo voy a poner en parejas. Uno hace la pregunta, el otro contesta la pregunta. Cuando hayan terminado las cinco preguntas, when you have finished the five questions. Then you switch role. Entonces van a cambiar los roles. Si yo estaba preguntando, ahora voy a contestar. ¿Está de acuerdo? ¿Estamos de acuerdo? Yes. Ok, yes. very good. So, did you take a picture? Oh, yes? Wait a minute. Ok, no problem. Okay, did you take a picture? Okay? Yes. Okay, voy a dejar de compartir, lo quiero ver. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. But the one that is uh, uneven, uneven, el que quede sin pareja, ese va a practicar conmigo. Okay, so I'm going to break you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Vaya están los diez. Okay, I'm going to make five couples, okay? One, three, four, five. Okay, very good. And go. Reina, go with Saul in room number one. Fernando and Lorena, room number two. Luis and Mario, room number three. Estela and Gerardo, room number four. En Carmen, will practice with me, okay? Go, Mario, room number three, please, Mario, okay. Very good, let me share the screen, Carmen. Okay, so you're gonna practice with me, Carmen. Do you check your email every day? Okay. Yes. Yes, I check my email, my email every day. What time do you eat lunch? At uh, at one p.m. Okay. Does this class start at eight o'clock? No, sé, no. El micrófono está teniendo problemas. Number three, me dijo. Yeah, number three. Does this class start at eight o'clock? No. No, this class start at nine o'clock. Okay. Do you? When do you study English? I study English in the evening. 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 Uh huh. I study English in the evening. Okay, uh, when do you and your friends play sports? Ah, no, do you and your friends play sports on weekends? Yes, we play soccer on Saturdays. Okay, now you ask the question, I answer the questions, okay? Okay, okay, number one. Number one. Do you check? Do you check your email every day? 
Yes, I check my email every day. Number two. Does this class start at? No, number two, number two. No, number two, Carmen. Oh, sorry, 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 it's okay, sorry. It's okay, it's okay. What time do you eat lunch? At 1 p.m., number three. Does this class start at eight o'clock? No, this class starts at nine o'clock. Okay, number four. Number four. Do you study English? No, when, when, remember, when? When, when, uh -huh. do, when do you study English? I study English in the evening. Okay, number five. Yeah, number five. Do you and your friends, do you and your friends play sports on weekends? Yes, we play soccer on Saturdays, very good. Now? Let me stop everyone so they can come back, okay? Excellent, Carmen. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, Luis, did you finish? Teacher. Yes, sir. Did you finish practicing with Mario Luis? Hello, ¿qué sucede? Que yo este, estoy teniendo problemas con lo que es con la conexión aquí donde vivo. Es por ah. el viento y todo eso. Ah, vaya. Ok, ok. Ok, perfect. Eh, now, let me see all of you. Ok, very good. Let me stop sharing to see who else is in class. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, okay. Estela is, ah, Estela is right here. Okay, now let me share. Okay, we are going to move to the next, to the next page. Okay, listening. Marcia's weekly routine. Okay, so listen to Marcia talk about her weekly routine. So, when you hear that she get up early on Monday, on Tuesday, or Wednesday, you write it down. Usted lo escribe. Okay? Monday, Tuesday. Go to work Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. Usted, you are going to write what day she goes to work. What day she exercises. What day she sees friends. What day she sees family. And what day she studies. Are you ready? Here we go. Listen. Page four. I have a question. Exercise eight. Hola. I have a question, teacher. Yes, what is your question? What, what's the meaning of weekly? Weekly, semanalmente, eh, semanalmente. Thank okay, you. weekly. Weekly. Monthly, monthly, mensualmente. Annually, anualmente. Daily, diariamente. Weekly, semanalmente. Is that clear? Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, here we go. Listen. Marsha's weekly routine. Listen to Marsha talk about her weekly routine. Check the dates she does each day. Do you get up early every day, Marcia? Well, no. I only get up early on weekdays and on Saturdays. I go to school from Monday to Friday, and I work on Saturdays. So I get up around 7 o'clock. How about on Sundays? On Sundays? Then I sleep late. Okay, so what time, what time does... Marsha, get up early. Um, 
Turn on your microphones, please. What time does Marcia get up early? What days? Saturday. Saturdays? Get up early, early. Turn on your microphones. Okay, you tell me. You didn't listen? No escucharon? Tuesday. Repeat the audio, please. Oh. Okay, I will repeat the audio. Listen carefully. Okay? What else do you do? Listen to Marsha talk about her weekly routine. Check the days she does each thing. Do you get up early every day, Marsha? No. I only get up early on weekdays and on Saturdays. I go to school from Monday to Friday, and I work on Saturdays. So I get up around 7 o'clock. How about on Sundays? On Sundays? Then I sleep late. Okay, so what days does Marsha get up early? Saturday. Saturday. Monday. 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 Uh -huh. She says all weekdays. Remember weekdays? Weekdays are Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Because she has to go to school. And Saturday, she works. So she has to get up early. But Sunday, she get up late. Listen again. About her weekly routine. Check the days she does each day. Do you get up early every day, Marcia? Well, no. I only get up early on weekdays and on Saturdays. I go to school from Monday to Friday, and I work on Saturdays. So I get up around 7 o'clock. How about on Sundays? On Sundays? Then I sleep late. What else do you do? Is that clear? Yeah. Yes. So she gets up early Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. The only day that she get up that she gets up late is Sunday. Okay, now go to work. What days does she go to work? Saturday. Saturday, that's correct. Okay, what days does she go to work? Saturday. Saturday. Listen, listen carefully. Do you get up early every day, Marsha? No, no. I always get up early on Tuesdays and on Saturday. Okay. Cuando esté la grabación, apaguemos el micrófono para que no haya interrupción. Vale, ok, lo voy a volver a poner. Do you get up early every day, Marcia? Well, no. I only get up early on weekdays and on Saturdays. I go to school from Monday to Friday, and I work on Saturdays, so I get... And I work on Saturday, so she goes to work only on Saturdays, okay? Yeah. Okay, now let's see, exercise, see friends, and see family, let's see. Get up around 7 o'clock. How about on Sundays? On Sundays? Then I sleep late. What else do you do? I mean, do you exercise during the week? Yes, but not every day. I swim three times a week, on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Oh, and I also play tennis on Saturdays after work. So I exercise four days a week. Okay, what days does she exercise? Turn on your microphones. Monday, Thursday, Monday, Tuesday, Monday, Thursday, Tuesday, Thursday, 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 and Saturday. And Saturday. I don't okay. remember. <laughs> After work. Okay, yeah, that is correct. Listen, listen. On Sunday, then I sleep late. 
What else do you do? I mean, do you exercise during the week? Yes, but not every day. I swim three times a week, on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Oh, and I also play tennis on Saturdays after work. So I exercise four days a week. Okay, so she goes swimming on Monday, on Tuesdays, Tuesday and, and on Thursday. And she plays tennis Saturday. on Saturday. Very good. Saturday. Now, let's keep on listening. See, friends, let's see. What about the rest of the weekend? When do you see your friends and family? Let's see. I see friends on Fridays and Saturdays. That's in the evening. And I visit my family on Sundays. When okay, so when does she see friends? Saturday. Only Saturday? Saturday? Friday. And Friday. Friday, right? Friday and Saturday. And when does she see family? Sunday. 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 On Sunday. Very good. Listen. Saturdays after work. So I exercise four days a week. What about the rest of the weekend? When do you see your friends and family? Let's see. I see friends on Fridays and Saturdays. That's in the evening. And I visit my family on Sundays. When do you study? Okay, so... She see friends on Friday and on Saturday. Okay. And she sees her family on Sunday. 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 Now, when does she study? Let's see. Every day. Wow. Okay. You're really busy. Every day. <laughs> Every day. When does she study? Every day. Every day. Every day. Very good. Very good. Now... Okay, uh, let's go to the workbook, okay? We're going to go to the workbook, okay? Workbook. Okay, now. Okay, exercise number... Exercise number three. Okay, third person singular endings. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, Gerardo. Now, you see dance? Dances. Do, does. Okay, so I want you to tell me the base form and the third person singular ending. Okay. For example, dance, dances. Do, does. Gerardo, number three. Goes. Okay, go. Remember, go. Goes. 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 Okay, very good. Uh, let me see. Saul Balmore, number four. Have, has. Have, has. Lorena, number five. Lorena, number five. Live, lives. Live, lives. Number six. Eh, Fernando? Eh, right, right. Right, rides. Okay, very good. Eh, Estela, number seven. Sleep, sleeps. Very good. Carmen, study. Studies. Studies. Uh, Luis, number nine. Take, take. Takes. Takes. Uh, Reina, use. Use, uses. Uses. Very good. Let me see. Mario. Work, works. Walk, walks. Very good. Volunteer for the last one. One volunteer. Watches. 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 Watch, watches. watches. Okay, everybody, repeat after me. Dance, dances. Dance, dances. Do, does. 
Do this. Go, goes. Go, goes. Go, Have, has. Have, has. Leave, leaves. Leave, leaves. Ride, rides. Sleep, sleeps. Sleep, sleeps. Sleep, Study, studies. Study, studies. Take, takes. Take, takes. Use, uses. Use, uses. Walk, walks. Walk, walks. Watch, watches. Watch, watches. Okay, very good. Now, look. True or false? Are these sentences are these sentences true for you? Check. For you, for you. I live in the city. True or false? Yeah, true. 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 I have a car. True or false? Okay. I live in an apartment. True or false? False. I live with my parents. True or false? False. True. True. Okay. I do my homework at school. True. True. False. <laughs> okay. Now, this one. <laughs> I do my homework alone. True. 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 I ride my bike to school. False. 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 I have sisters. False. False. I have a sister. False. I have brothers. True. 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 I have a brother. False. False. I work downtown. True. True. Okay, repeat after me. Everybody, turn on your microphone, Reina. I live in the city. I live in the city. I have a car. I have a car. I live in an apartment. I live in an apartment. I live with my parents. I live with my parents. I do my homework at school. I do my homework at school. I do my homework alone. I do my homework alone. I ride my bike to school. I ride my bike to school. I have sisters. I have sisters. I have brothers. I have, I have brothers. brothers. I work downtown. I, I work downtown. downtown. Ahora, si fueran negativas, if they were negatives, you're going to say, I don't live in the city. Repeat after me. I don't live in the city. I don't live, I don't live in the city. I don't have a car. I don't have a car. I don't live in an apartment. I don't, I don't live in a parents. I don't live with my parents. I don't live, I don't live, live with, with my, my parents. parents. I don't do my homework at school. I don't do my homework at school. I do my homework alone. I do, I do my, my homework alone. I'm sorry, they are negatives. I don't do my homework alone. I don't, I don't do, do my, my work 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 alone. alone. I don't ride my bike to school. I don't, I don't ride, ride my, my bike, bike to school. school. I don't have sisters. I don't, I don't have, have sisters. sisters. I don't have brothers. I don't, I don't have, have brothers. brothers. I don't work downtown. I don't, I don't, work, don't work downtown. 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 Okay, now look. If it is true, you're going to say, I live in the city. If it is false, you're going to say, I don't live in the city. Okay? So I'm going to put you in pairs, and you're going to tell your classmate, I live in the city if it is true, or I don't live in the city if it is false. So you're going to tell them all 
the ten. Okay. Affirmative or negative. When you finish, then your classmate is going to tell you the ten sentences. If they are true, affirmative. If they are false, negative. Is that clear? Yeah. Vaya. Se lo voy a decir en español. Ahora lo voy a poner en parejas y usted le va a decir las 10 oraciones a su compañero. Si la oración es verdadera para usted, usted va a hacer la afirmativa. Si la oración es falsa, usted va a decir, I don't live in the city. Cuando su compañero termine, ahora va a ir su compañero a decirle las 10 oraciones. ¿Está claro? Yeah. Ok, very good. Uh, let me see how many we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Pedro. Hello, Pedro. Ok, I'm going to... I'm Tengo going to... Señal. Ah, lo Vaya, está fallando un poco la señal del internet. No importa, trate, trate. Ok, ahí vamos. Sí, sí. sí. Ok, eh, sal, eh, room number one, Fernando y Mario. Room number two, Pedro en Saúl, Balmore. Room number three, Carmen en Luis. Room number four, Gerardo en Reina. Room number five, Estela en Lorena. Okay, go ahead. Go join your room. Okay, un, un hacia el salón. Carmen, room number three. Eh, Reina, room number four. Carmen, room number three, please. Reina, room number... Hola, Luis. Ahorita, ahorita ya vamos. Lo voy a sacar porque se me olvidó preguntarle ah, okay. si habían tomado foto. Entonces, ah, okay. la actividad <risa> lo estoy sacando para que le tome foto porque se me olvidó. Ok, ok. Ok, ahorita ya regresan en 10 segundos, 15. Ok. Ok. Ya las enviamos al grupo. Ok, lo saqué porque se me olvidó preguntarle si le habían tomado fotos. No sé si le tomaron foto a la actividad. Yo dije, y hey, lo mandé y no, no tomaron foto. Le voy a poner para que usted le tome foto, ¿ok? Tómele foto a la actividad, por favor. Se la voy a hacer un poquito más grande, ¿ok? Ya está en el grupo. ¿Ya está en el grupo? Sí. Vaya, ok. Entonces, si ya está en el grupo, búsquela en el grupo y yo o tomele foto. El que quiera tomarle foto, me avisa. Voy a dar medio minuto, 30 segundos, ¿ya? Vaya, ahora sí lo voy a, lo voy a poner en grupos. Las mismas parejas, don't worry. Vaya, Fernando y Mario... Room number one, Pedro and Saúl. Room number two, Carmen and Luis. Room number three, Gerardo. Room number four, con Reina, Estela and Lorena. Room number five, go ahead. Lorena, room number... Room number five, Lorena, Carmen, room number three, Carmen. Carmen, room number three, Carmen. Carmen, Carmen, room number three, okay.
Okay, very good. Everybody's out. Okay, now uh, we are going to work on this reading. Okay. Now, interviews, entrevistas, the bulletin, home, lo llevo a casa, news, noticias, foros y para eh, registrarse, para loguearse. What's your schedule like? What's your schedule like? Look at the picture and labels. Who gets up early? Who gets up late? Okay, so I want you to read and I want you to listen, okay? Page 41, exercise 11, reading. What's your schedule like? Student reporter Mike Starr talks to people on the street about their schedules. Brittany Davis, college student. What's your schedule like? My classes start at 8 a.m., so I get up at 7 and take the bus to school. When do your classes end? They end at noon. Then I have a job at the library. So when do you study? My only time to study is in the evening, from 8 until midnight. Justin Reed, City Tour Guide. What's your schedule like? I get up at 6.15 a.m. and start work at 9. And what do you do before work? I go for a run at 6.30 a.m. and then I have breakfast at 7. And after work? I finish at 6 p.m. and I have dinner downtown. Do you work every day? No, I work on Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Maya Chu, rock musician. What's your schedule like? Well, I work at night. I go to work at 10 p.m. and I play until 3 a.m. What do you do after work? I have dinner at 3.30 or 4. Then I take a taxi home. What time do you go to bed? I go to bed at 5 in the morning. Okay, do you have any questions? Okay, Brittany Davis, Brittany Davis. A, read the article, then number the activities each person, in each person scheduled from one to five. Okay, what is the first thing that she does? Que es lo primero que ella hace? Get up at seven. Okay, so get up at... Seven is the first. So that is number one. What is number two? She goes to class. Ah, uh, she goes, she is stuck. Ah, uh, she goes to classes. That is number two. What is number three? Uh, she goes to the work. She goes, uh -huh. she, mm -hmm. she works. That is number three. Okay, what else? Yeah. And then? Uh, no, no, no. The three is take the bus, the bus. Ah, wait. No, so she, yeah. So she get up, she gets up. Is number one. Then she is the two. No, Bring she no, she goes to school is number two. Yeah. And three she takes, takes the bus, bus, number two. She goes to classes, number three. 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 Oh. She three. works number four and oh, she studies she's... number five. Number five. Yes. Okay, very good. Now what about Justin Reed? Number one, he gets up. Get up. Get up. He gets up. Get Number get two, uh, he works. No, he goes for a run. He goes so a run. he goes for a run. He is goes for a run. Two. 
Number three at seven. Uh, he, breakfast. I he breakfast. He has breakfast. Ah, he has breakfast. He has breakfast. Is number three. Then number four. He start work. He start work. He start work is number four. And number five. It's dinner. It's dinner. It's dinner. Okay. What about Maya Shu? Work. First, she, she goes to work. work, right? She goes to work at 10 p.m., number one. one. Number she two? To... Dinner? She... Dinner? No, no, she goes to work and then... She... She finished work at three. Uh, right, she finished uh, work at three. Sure. She has dinner at 3.30. Uh -huh. She has dinner at 3.30 is number three. Yes. She finishes work is number two. She goes to bed and she goes home is number four. Yeah. Yeah. And then she goes to bed at five o'clock. Okay? Yeah. Is that clear? Yeah. yeah. Yes, very good. Okay, so now I want to talk to you about the platform. Okay, so this is the reading. Okay, this is the reading. Okay, so you have to do the check. Okay, now here. Okay, now. Uh, Brittany Davis, she goes to class, she takes the bus, she works, she study, and she gets up. Now, Joshua Barnes, so you have it right here. So you have to do this, selection option, one, two, three, or five. Then the next one, then the next one, and the next one. Then Maya Black, rock musician, and then you have that, you have to put what is exactly as we did. Is that clear? Está claro? Yes. Yes. Hay alguna pregunta? Vaya, mire. Tiene que completar la plataforma hasta aquí. Okay? Okay. 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 Hasta aquí. Para que el lunes ya comencemos con la siguiente opción. Si usted ve... Aquí estaremos terminando la primera parte. ¿Ok? Y ahí vamos con la lección número 2 que pertenece a la sección 2. Entonces, si usted ve, tenemos, si regresamos al curso, si regresamos al curso, usted ve que tenemos cinco secciones y apenas hemos terminado la sección 1. Así que procuremos que para el día lunes toda la sección 1 quede terminada. ¿De acuerdo? Hey. Vaya, ¿tienen alguna pregunta acerca de los ejercicios en la plataforma? ¿Tienen alguna pregunta acerca de los ejercicios en la plataforma? No. No. Entonces, si no hay preguntas ahí, si todo está claro, vamos a regresar aquí, ¿verdad? Vamos a regresar a estos ejercicios que nosotros teníamos aquí. ¿Se acuerda que habíamos dicho que íbamos a hacer este ejercicio si teníamos tiempo, verdad? Por ejemplo, ¿cómo era? I play, ¿cuál es la negativa? I don't play. I don't play. I don't play. Y la pregunta... Do I play? Do I play? Do I play? Vale. Ahora, eh, Reina, encienda su micrófono. You help. ¿Cuál es la negativa? You don't help. You don't help. Mario Nolasco. What is the question? Ah, Mario Nolasco se nos fue. Fernando Martínez. What is the question? Do you help? Do you help? Very good. Mario, ya regresó Mario. Aquí la negativa es he does not answer. 
What is the affirmative? Mario, what is the affirmative? Perdón, que me levanté. Vaya, pero ¿cuál es la afirmativa? La negativa es He does not he answer. ¿Cuál es la afirmativa? He does answer. No. He does answer. No. Vamos a ver, vamos a probar con alguien más. Gerardo, ¿cuál sería la afirmativa? Me algo, teacher. Estoy bien. Ajá. He does not answer en la negativa. ¿Cuál sería la afirmativa? He answers. He answers. He answers. De verdad, porque answer, estoy hablando de he. Answer. ¿Entendió, Mario? Yes, he, yes. he answers. ¿Y cuál sería la pregunta, Saúl Balmore? Does he answer? Does he answer? No, don't, no pronuncien la W, por favor. Ok, vamos a ver. ¿Quiénes más están aquí? Ok, Saúl Balmore. The question is, does she sing? What is the affirmative? She sings. She sings. Very good. Estela, what is the negative? She does she doesn't sing. Very good. Now, Luis, the affirmative is it rains. What is the negative? It doesn't rain. It doesn't rain. What is the question, Carmen? It's right. Encienda su micrófono, Carmen. What is the question? It's right. Does it rain? Does it rain? Very good, very good. Okay, let's do it again. Reina, the question is, do we dream? What is the affirmative? Do we dream? We dream. Uh -huh. What is your question? And it se utilizaba el does. Sí. Acuérdese. Vale, vamos a regresar aquí. ¿eh? Acuérdese que era para... He, she, and it. Aquí se lo voy a mostrar. ¿ve? Aquí dice, ¿verdad? Para. Quiero ver. Aquí dice, ¿verdad? para he, para she, o it. ¿Ok? ¿De acuerdo? Para he, she, and it. ¿Ok? Ok. Bien, excelente. Excelente. Vamos a ver a. Mario. Okay, so we dream, do we dream? What is the negative, Mario? We don't dream. We don't dream. Lorena, you don't read. What is the affirmative? You read. Very good. Saul Balmore, what is the question? Do you read? Do you read? Fernando. The question is, do they work? What is the affirmative? And they work. They work. Very good. Uh, Estela, what is the negative? They don't work. They don't work. Perfect. Vaya, habíamos hecho el ejercicio 2 y el ejercicio 3. No me acuerdo si habíamos hecho el ejercicio 4. Habíamos hecho el ejercicio 4. Dijo no. que se podía. No. Lo hicieron. Ok, veamos. Entonces aquí tenemos que hacer preguntas. We have to ask questions. So, because it's she, I'm going to ask, I'm going to use the auxiliary does. Ok. Does she collect stamps? Collect stamps. Vaya, ahora. Fíjense bien, quiero preguntarle algo de todo este ejercicio. ¿Hay preguntas acerca del vocabulario? ¿No? ¿Todo está claro? ¿Qué significa collect? Coleccionar. Coleccionar, ¿verdad? En este caso es coleccionar. Vamos a ver. A hamster, ¿sabe lo que es un hamster, va? 
Eso, ratoncito. El animalito. Como unos ratoncitos, un poquito más grandes. Ok. Vale. En la tres, play fútbol, boring. Right, take note, bye. Ok, veamos, ¿cómo sería la, la, the question in number, number two? Eh, Gerardo, number two, how is the question? Is, do the, do the, do, do the, do the, uh -huh. do they play again. Play, again. Do they play again that is correct that is perfect okay Saul Balmore what is the next question does the cat sleep in the cat bed does the cat sleep in the cat's bed in the cat's bed. Excellent, very good. Okay, Mario, what is the next question? Does she drink often? Does she often? often? Does she often dream? Al revés. Era. Al sí, revés. Sí. Siempre. El adverbio de frecuencia va entre el, el, el pronombre y el verbo. Okay. Bye. Eh, the next one, eh, Luis. Does he play football? Ah, ok. Does he play street ball? Ok, very good. Excellent. Eh, Fernando, what is the next question? Eh, you are from Paris. Pero you are from Paris es una afirmación. ¿Cómo es la pregunta? Are ah, you? Ah, very good. Are you from Paris? Very good. Excellent. Okay, Estela, what is number seven? Do the pupils? Mm -hmm. Do the pupils wear a school uniform? Wear a school uniform. Very good. Okay. Now, very good. What is the meaning? Okay. Vamos a ver. Uh, pupils. Pupils significa alumnos. Wear es usar ropa. Entonces, do the people wear a school uniform? Lo, uh, uh, ¿Usan los alumnos eh, uniforme de escuela? Okay. Very good. It's like students. It's like students. Ajá, correcto. Pero más que todo significa alumnos. Ok, very good. Carmen, the next one. Do you go to the cinema? Do you go to the cinema? Do you go to the cinema? Okay, very good. The next one, Reina. Does she has friends? Aha, uh -huh, pero no has. Oh. Acuérdese que el verbo aquí ya tomó la conjugación y el aquí el verbo va en su forma base ok friends okay. very good ok and I don't know who's next Saul Balmore does he read books does he read books ok very good and then you have it Ok, vaya, de tarea, haga el ejercicio 5 y el ejercicio 6. Ok, ejercicio 5 y ejercicio 6 de tarea para el día lunes, ¿de acuerdo?
teacher, y en el ejercicio 6 podemos usar los verbos que nosotros querramos. No, aquí le da clic, le, le va a, aquí es read or reads. Bueno, trate Pero, de ponerle, sí, como no lo tienen ustedes, trate no de... No lo que, tenemos. Sí, no para que trate de usar la lógica. Por ejemplo, aquí, de libros es de leer. De, de la discoteca es de ir. De, on Sundays, vaya, ahí tienen. Llover, ir en his sister, watch. Ah, pues sí. ¿Verdad? Y... ¿Dónde watch? En el cuatro. Watch. Y en el último es hurry o hurries. Well, el tres uh, es... Sí, porque yo le puse work ahí. Vaya, está bien, no, pero con tal de que tenga lógica. En el cinco work y en el cuatro drawing. No importa, con tal de que tenga lógica y eso es lo que estamos buscando. De que usted... Uh, que, sure. No importa, con tal de que tenga lógica, para mí es bien. Okay, sí, es que ya lo hice, pero le puse verbo porque no se le veía allí el que yo consideraba razón? que pegaba. De acuerdo, tiene razón, pero ahora ya podemos. Ok, trabajen en la plataforma, por favor, ¿verdad? Terminemos la sección 1 que ya quede terminada para el día lunes. ¿De acuerdo? Yo aquí voy a estar monitoreando, mire. Le voy a mostrar. Yo aquí lo estoy monitoreando. ¿Quiénes son? Mire, ¿quiénes ya han hecho la tarea? Yo aquí los estoy monitoreando a todos, ¿verdad? ¿Quiénes van haciendo la tarea? Mire, aquí voy a la página número dos. ¿Y quiénes ya han terminado la tarea? Mire, Fernando ya la terminó. Eh, Lorena ya la terminó. Luis Antonio ya la terminó. Mar Marilyn ya la terminó, Mario Nolasco ya la terminó, eh, Estela Díaz ya la terminó, y ahí los estoy monitoreando, ¿de acuerdo? Así que pónganse la pila para que el lunes comencemos con la sección 2 y podamos adelantar un poquito de la sección 3 al final de la semana, ¿ok? Have a nice weekend, enjoy yourself and see you Monday, ¿ok? Bye bye. Good night, guys. Thanks. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night.